good evening, all tuning in. Welcome to a, a live show this evening. So I'm, I'm a little bit late, but we've just finished with our exhibition at the A4 Studios with their open um, gallery night. So, what's everyone up to? Um, as you can see, I'm on Stamford New Road this evening. It's just it's a bit noisy, so going to have a little walk with me. Andy's on on the camera tonight, guys. Hey, folks. It's actually quite weird, Andy, doing the live show with me. Strange things have happened, Chris. I know, yeah. Don't know it. And stranger things might happen. <laughs> yeah. I didn't realise that Car Screen's going to be now. Well, at least we've got a little exclusive to tell you in a minute as well. We'll just get in there in a minute. This is where the uh, Ultrion Limited are working in the station house, which I'll tell you all about in a, in a bit, too. Say hi to one, Chris. Who? Hi to one. Hi Anne, you okay? And Chris Aki Atkinson. Woohoo! Yeah, I need to do that for Chris. <laughs> oh, I know it does quite differently tonight on doing this. Because I've had a really good few days. I'm more happy. <laughs> but you'll find out a little bit on Sunday. Won't be Andy, because Andy keeps winding me up. Who remembers the old Bentley's building? This used to be uh, Kelly's Bar. It's fucking good, isn't it? These are the uh, Altinger in Bloom plants in there. And don't worry guys, there's nothing... Well, what we've heard, there's nothing going in the building. They're just making sure the, uh, the building's okay. Hi to Rita, who's joined us. Hi Rita, you okay? Is that our friend Rita? That's our friend Rita. The one that's been messaging you. That's the, that's the Rita. Hi Rita. So this is the house of Fraser. Which is good. We've got Georgia and we've got our Actually, do you think we should show them a few new shops in the Stanford Quarter? <sighs> well, let's do that. Yeah, because I think we should. Things have changed in the Stanford Quarter this week. And we don't care where barging in. But if you've got any uh, complaints, just send them to Andy at Altingham News. <laughs> <laughs> One of our new updates, uh, the old new look building, going to be flannels. They sell clothes, really expensive clothes. Does anyone remember flannels? Flannels is still around, but I've never seen one before. Unless you mean the ones in the bathroom. I've seen quite a few. So yeah, it's going to be flannels, we think. And then the new one we've got as well, we've got Real Buzz, which is a running and fitness specialist. Good. <laughs> and on that one as well, that used to be water stones at one time. That's got a new front on too. Hi to Evelyn. Evelyn, hi Evelyn. A bit of mess going on in this back of course, but I think, uh, I, th I think the cost just needs to start clearing up a bit. Look at the mess. 
thing is that a lot of people do actually complain about the mess in Altrincham. But so what? We uh, we just post what people actually send to us and people moaning about things. Oh, I'm excited to show you some brand new news as well from us today. I'll show you that in a minute. I'm excited. Actually, yeah, I'll tell you now. What would you say if Cornwall came to Altrincham? Oh, my word. I used to live in Cornwall. I was there for 16 months. I didn't realise they were following me. But it's the uh, Warren's Bakery. Does anyone remember? Does anyone know Warren's Bakery? Warren's Bakery. Um, they're coming now. Well, I'll uh, take you to their side now if you like. It's actually quite do good doing a live show in the Stanford Quarter because a lot of things have changed. But if you want me, just let just speak to Andy first. He does all the complaints. Everyone complains about what we do, but we're only doing it to keep all stream alive. Unlike some pages that we've had. Isn't it Andy? That's right. We won't mention any names. This isn't my show. We'll save it for Wednesday. Yes. Yes, it's all good. Yeah, it's really good. So here, this used to be a bakery. Do you remember the name bakery? Greenalls. Greenalls. This used to be Greenalls, and now they can use this. It's going to be Warren's Bakery, so hopefully it will be open very soon. This used to be all the old pizza hut building. I'm hoping uh, we saw we saw uh, some guys measuring up windows and stuff at the building a few weeks ago, so hopefully. Something might be going in there. So, what would you like it to be, Andy? McDonald's, I've told you this before. McDonald's. I love me Mackies. Well, they could have another one there, maybe, yeah. But everyone wanted, everyone wanted Nando's, and guess what? We've got a Nando's. I still haven't been in there, though. But it's always jam packed all the time. Look at it. And yes, they do have veggie dishes, apparently. What can we do? Right, let's go. Oh, I better not tell you something. There's actually um, Coronation Street being recording this week in Altrincham, and we've seen a, a, a few familiar faces. Help me, Andy. We keep bumping into Todd, don't we? He's actually funny enough. He actually comes into Sainsbury's in sale, and uh, he's been. He's been buying quite a few different things each day and yesterday he actually went and bought a set of knife and forks. So I wonder if he's actually moving into Altrincham or Sale or around the, around the area. If anyone knows any gossip just let us know and we can break the news. But yeah, I'm, uh, I'm just... Uh, I don't know what, it's just really good. Oh, anyone been to Granny T's yet? It's good in there. We should go in there one day, Andy. I'm sure that guy was checking me out. I'm sorry, guys. Um, I'll play you on Sunday. <laughs> How do you have a secret, Chris? I do, but you'll find out on Sunday. What, the secret that I already know? Yes, you know. Oh, yes. The secret you already know, Andy. Well, Not much of a secret then, is it? Yeah, of course you know, is what I'm saying, because you keep winding me up on these live shows on a Sunday. Oh, yeah, or it won't be a secret after next my live next Wednesday. 
Oh no. No, no, you can't talk about me. You're not allowed. You're not allowed to talk about you, 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 your buddy. Your business buddy. Well, you can at a certain stage, but don't really go into detail. But even though a lot of people just gossip about me, it's, it's, it's good to be talked about. At least they're not talking about anyone else. I mean, this is all to you and everyone's just like... Mm -hmm. Everybody's like what, Chris? We're who? Anyone been to Subway tonight? I wonder if they'll let us in what you know, but I'm not. I'm not, I'm not like some people tweeting you eat. And I love this gallery. The guy in there is fantastic. I'm, I'm sorry if you're watching, um, but I forgot your name. Ah! Woohoo! Actually, people fright me, but guess what? Screw you. <laughs> Oh, we've had a few people stay in the travel lodge. Oh, we have Andy. It's really good. Are we alright to go up this way, Andy? We're good that way. Things are going on this week. Today, Force just uh, had a, a launch night tonight with the uh, open. Is it Air Open Gallery? Or? Air Open, yeah. Yeah, that's it. That's, that's the, the one. name of the new exhibition. Open for a couple of weeks. Please pop down, show me support. Yeah, we did like a little brief live on there tonight on, on Ultra News. So keep on going. I'm just going to get this one. Hey, hey, you lie! You're you lie! I think you're gonna get some company, Chris. I don't want any. You're gonna get some company, Chris. Well, at least he actually took the decency just to do a bit of It's like being on the news, isn't it? You've always got that person when you're doing a live show or filming or anything it's like being on the BBC and the filming and you've always got that guy at the background and he always goes <laughs> it's true though isn't it Andy at least people know what we do it's really nice to see it so I'm excited oh does anyone, anyone remember the old hospital in Altrium they've actually as you know, it's been knocked down, but now they've uh, they've started to rebuild the the new hub. Wow, this is going to look really good. That does look really. That's going to be like a new hub centre. It's going to have the new. It's going to have a new library, doctors, and some more other items in there. Andy. Where's that, Chris? Oh, that place where we went to with our judge last week. So we'll do that next Thursday. Oh, uh, yes. Yeah, because we said we would do something there. Huh? We'll have to look into it a bit more. Yeah, well, this is Market Street. Day nursery. Oh, I'm excited. Nursery, a new nursery. Ooh, it's a bit messy though. Well, carry on. You're doing a good job. <laughs> oh, it's fun. It's fun. It's fun. 
Andy, while we're actually live, is there anything you want to talk to the camera about tonight? Anything I want to talk to the camera about? Um, no, I'm, I'm having a night off tonight. I'm having a night off tonight, so you can see I've got all my kit with me. I'm the technology side of the camera tonight because my producer is away in Wales. I had to do it all on my own last night. Thank you for your support last night. Thank you for the support you've shown me when I talk about uh, what's going on for me. Hopefully I'm going to return to that with a friend of mine next week who joined me on a journey perhaps that we shouldn't have taken to hide from it, but that's all for next week. Anyway, back to Chris's show. Hi guys, Mandy's just joined us. Hi Mandy. Funny enough Mandy, I've seen a lady today just like you and I thought it was you, I nearly preached, I nearly asked if it was you. But I better not, you, you're, like, you, you're at home aren't you, so, yeah. As you can see this is the old market, but it's very different now, it's what it was years ago. I, I actually miss it being a proper market, and I think Altrincham does as well. But the food market, the, well the food hall, when it opened in 2014 was it Andy? Uh, as the food sure, place hey. around that a bit earlier. It, a, a lot of things, a lot of people going, oh, you don't want to do that. But there was a load of businesses actually were in there, in there with the market, and they all trade out. And now it's a food hall, and all the people it's bought into Altingham, you've got new shops as well. Altingham's changing all the time, and I'm just so happy about it because, as you say, a lot, a lot of people enjoy what they do with their. It's quite funny, they can't believe the camera's in front of my face. I'm not normally shy on the camera. But <laughs> it's Mandy's what... panicking at the fact there might be two of us. Oh, Mandy. Well, don't worry, don't worry, it wasn't you. I, I have to double check. That's why I said, yeah, I'll double check. But as you can see, altering on a Thursday night, people stuffing the faces, having a good time. This is, this is actually, this is Food World of Altrincham. Food World. Maybe that's something we can work on, Andy. Food World. Oh, actually, no, we might better not say that people might make pages about it. But hey. I wonder if there's a veggie option. <laughs> well, I think there is, actually. Do you think we should ask anyone? <laughs> yeah. Oh, fancy a taxi, guy. These plants are nice, aren't they? From juice, I like these. These are from the uh, Ultramin Bloom uh, little thing. <laughs> oh, very good! Uh, well, as you can see, this is the Ultramin Town Hall. But wow, what a stunning building this is. It's just a shame people have to move in. To different things and it, and it closed down. People still can get married here, you know. I didn't realise that for a few weeks ago. Actually, I'm not saying anything, but what a stunning building to get married in. Oh, and funny enough, there's a wedding shop as well. There must be a wedding coming on, Andy. <laughs> Have you got your hat? It. No, I'm not saying anything. No. I'm going to actually finish it here tonight at the, uh, the old Ultraman Town Hall, but it's Thursday evening and people are enjoying themselves and I think me and Andy should actually go and join them, don't you think, Andy? That's a possibility. Yeah, there might be some good food there. Maybe if we tweet then, then we eat. <laughs> but we're not like that. Mandy's Just... saying, come on, go spill, Chris. She wants to know your secret. My secret? Well, put it this way, things have changed in the last week. With myself, that'll let you guys think about that, but you've got to come back on the, uh, Sunday night at 8 o'clock for a little bit more of that. And anyway, before I go, thanks for, for the support for tonight, and thanks for everyone that's actually bombed a bit, the, the live with them, them guys. But hey, I enjoyed it. So, have a good few days ahead and a good weekend. Be good now and we'll see you on Sunday at 8 o'clock.
in the studio. See you later, old finger.